Very long road. Feel good to be here. I'm ready to make some plays. It's gonna be a great game. Start of the season, 2016. Be ready. Still a nation. It's gonna be a good one. Very quick throw. First career catch for Eli Rogers. But all of last year, injured with a broken foot. Ben Roethlisberger told us last night, Coach, he could be the best slot receiver they've had since Ben's been there. Eli, first game Monday night, prime time, a lot of people watching. Did you think about how far you, you came just to get to that point at all? Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, before the game, I just kind of stepped off to the side. We were in a tunnel. It was like a little area. I stepped off to the side. Um, you know, I just kind of reflected on everything, you know, just from last year, just my whole journey. And, um, you know, I just kind of uh, was a little emotional right then. I didn't cry or anything like that, but I was a little emotional um, and, you know, just thought about everything. You started, you scored a touchdown, you made an impact. Did you take that in yet? Does it feel real now that it's actually happened? You have that first game under your belt? Yeah, it, it, it definitely feel real, but you know, I'm a guy, I never get like overexcited or underexcited about a situation. Or I just took in a moment and, um, you know, just ready to move forward. Now we got AFC matchup this week and, you know, I'm excited for my first AFC game. And they do a little toss over the middle as a catch and it's pulled in by Eli Rogers. Another fourth down splash play. Fourth and one, you guys decide to go to it. Did you know Ben was coming to you? I knew I would be open if I if I beat the guy in front of me. So, you know, I, I knew it was a, a great possibility that he could come to me, and he did. What does that mean, fourth and one, to do or die play that you were the guy he went to? Yeah, it was, it was a routine play, but it meant a lot. You know, it meant a lot. Like, he had a confidence in me. Um, you know, the offense had a confidence in me. So it meant a lot to me. Touchdown was a little goofy, but did you realize that it was bouncing off your face mask? How did that all go down? I actually didn't even know it bounced off my face mask until I seen a video. I'm like, oh, snap, it bounced off my face mask. <laughs> but I just kind of seen a ball in the air. I heard it bounce off of the dude's chest and um, seen the ball in the air and just locked in on it and caught the ball and got down. We've heard so much about you from training camp to this point forward from Coach Tomlin, Todd Haley, Ben Roethlisberger. There, there was probably some people last night watching the game thinking, I don't know who Eli Rogers is. Do you, does that motivate you? Does that give you a chip on your shoulder? How do you use that to continue progressing and getting better? Yeah, it definitely just have like a uh, chip on my shoulder, but it, 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 it motivates me also, you know, uh, just, just to go out there and perform at the highest level and perform the best that I, of my ability and you know I know that if I come out and work every day like I've been doing getting better you know people are going to um, definitely take notice in me and that, that'll play itself out. When did you realize that you had Ben's trust that you were somebody that he could go to? Around training camp I knew that I had I had his trust then because you know we started really building a uh, report and um, communicating better. Was it just the way he spoke to you or went to in practice or was there, you know, a telltale sign? It just amplified to a higher degree um, in training camp and as training camp progressed, you know, we had got into detail more about plays and assignments and understanding of each other as players. He said you like to ask him a lot of questions. Is that <laughs> true and what do you bug him about and ask him questions about? I ask him a lot of questions because, you know, you could, um, you can never know enough, and I feel like, um, you know, I'm still young in this offense. Even though I've been here a year, it's still kind of learning on the fly for me. So, you know, like I said, I'm a very detailed player, and I just try to get the um, get details to the to the teeth. So, is it you could be watching film, something strikes you, you go to Ben and ask a question, or is it the practice field, or are we talking just everywhere and anywhere? Yeah, if you need all, to know, you go to seven. Definitely, in all facets. You know, if I see something on field, I mean, on on the film, you know, I come to him and you know, kind of ask him and bump that across him, and we bounce ideas off each other. And so, you know, I, I, I like going out there and getting those physical reps, and you know, actually seeing it and feeling it, and then talking to him like that. I told you it was gonna be a good. One.